Hey you guys, what is going on bro? Uh, 87 here on Destiny for once, you know, because I never get on this game anymore. But no, seriously, I'm back on Destiny again. It's been a while. I don't even know what everybody wants from me, but people want stuff from me. I've got the Cryptarch, got Engram, just a blue. I've got packages. I saw this and I was like, what? And then... I looked it up and it's just a bunch of crap. That's just supposed to get me back playing Destiny. Anyway, I haven't played Destiny in a very, very, very long time. It's been like, like last time I played it was literally sure, and that was it. That was, like I haven't played it since. I just constantly play other games because I don't feel the need to play this game. What does she want? What do you want from me? I don't even know where Zur is. People just want stuff from me. Okay, I don't know what that is. I will find out all that stuff later. Is he down here? Anyway, yeah, I've not played Destiny. I don't even know where he is. Like, you could just tell I'm so prepared for this. No, but seriously, I just got my internet working. Like, I kept getting on Destiny. It kept kicking me from the game. It might kick me during this video. Hopefully not. Well, if it does, hopefully after I do the Zur. But, um, I couldn't get my computer to load. Things were crashing. I couldn't reopen them. It was awful. Like, torture to me. But now everything's working fine. Hopefully it stays working. Hopefully... Everything's just fine. Um, would it be over there? Let's check right here, right, real quick. So, no, and then a uh, bit, a bit of a. No. He's probably all the way at the other end of the map, just because. Why would it be at the end that I'm looking for? You know. Well, anyway, I just got my setup all together. I got um, everything all situated. I just got my, like, a couple days ago. It's been a really hard week on me. It was just school restarted, and it, it's been hard. It's been really hard. And I bet Jer's not even in this part. I bet I missed him. Oh, oh wait, no, there he is. Okay, I was like going to say, where did I miss him? So this is Jer. Let's go see what he has. Ready? So we already wasted, like, three minutes on this. Let's go and find out what he has. Is it your will to speak to me? Okay, so he's got first no backup plans. I actually think these are, wow. I actually think these are pretty good now. I remember when I first saw him, I was like, oh, these things are okay. But now, now that the year two, the shotgun thing is really good. And now that it has shotgun loader, get it, guys. Get it now. Get these because these are heaven. They're good. I'm pretty sure that a lot of people out there will want these because they got the shotgun loader. Okay, next we have uh, these knucklehead radar. This amazing thing just makes you look down sights when you aim with a primary weapon. Not secondary, not heavy, just primary. It's okay. I, I don't really like this thing at all just because it doesn't really benefit me that much. Next we got the Apotheosis Veal. This was just added, actually. Um, when you like use your super... You, like, regenerate your health. It's, like, usually really good with Sunbreaker. I think it would be good with any, actually, any super. Never mind. It's probably good with every super. It was really good in Crota's End, but I don't know about now. Probably still pretty good. Next, we got the Dragon's Breath. Now, I heard this has actually got a huge update uh, from last uh, gen. Not last gen. Why did I say last gen? From last DLC. It is apparently really good. Like, it destroyed Valis last week. I didn't even play the knife last week. But, you know, it destroyed him last week. Or a week before. I don't even remember when Nightfall was the fire damage one. But it destroyed him. And I, I heard about it. And I was like, wow. They actually did something good with that gun. Now it's Surplus. Did it have Surplus before? Uh, I don't know. But still. Oh, no, it had a Tripod. No, it doesn't have a Tripod. It's a good gun. Get it now. Oh, well, you still can. Next we have Legacy Engrams. I'm a couple short because I just got a bunch of strange coins. But no, this um, 
you can get like year one, you can get the Gallahorn. Who doesn't want that or the Yallerhorn? You know, I talked about that a lot and how I wanted it. And then when I released it, I about cried. <laughs> Go check out that video. It's pretty funny. Next, we got Plasma Drive and Stealth Drive. These change a sparrow that is blue. In, sorry, I'm like, I haven't played this game forever. I can't remember. Blue into a legendary sparrow. So, like, hold on. That is one of the ones you can get. You can also, like, change it up to, like, any kind of spare. You could buy from any of the vendors. It's pretty cool. But I don't know if it'd be worth 20 piece change coins. Next, we got heavy ammo synthesis. These are pretty good. I don't have much more, but, you know, I don't play this game, like, at all anymore. I have four, see? But, I, like I said, I don't play this game. Like, I, I, don't, I don't know. I guess if you did a lot of things in this game still, yeah, they'd be good. Next, we got three of coins. These are probably the best thing in this game. Like, I was still, like, I saw the same from last week. I probably am missing, like, a couple because, I don't know. Actually, how I'm missing a couple. But, I did, or maybe I did play. I don't remember. Okay, three of coins. They're good. Get them if you, show, if you so desire. But, it is your choice to get the three of coins because you're basically taking a chance. It's like gambling and taking a chance. But, will you get it? Who knows? Next, we have Glass Needles. These change an exotic's fate from something such as, like, let's say I have Discipline and Strength. I change it. Now it has Intellect and Strength. So now I can, and if I don't want that, I want Intellect and Discipline. I can change it again. It does reset the exotic stats, but well, don't let that fret you away from that. Next, we've got Mode of Light. Just a little heads up. I've never bought a Mode of Light in Destiny from Xur ever. And that's just saying something. So, that's it. That, that's all Zura has. That's a short video. I, 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 I've had a crappy week. I've had a crappy, like, everything's just been awful. It, it's been tough on me. I'm really tired. Internet just started working, and I'm like, like, I really was debating on doing it today, because I was, like, sitting there like, come on, I do it. I really want to, but yeah, I, I did. What's going on, man? Rock on, brother. Anyway, uh, I, I've been playing. You guys are probably wondering, why are you playing Destiny? Why aren't you playing Destiny? Because, well, there's games like Call of Duty. I just love Call of Duty. I love Call of Duty. Uh, Grand Theft Auto. I love Grand Theft Auto. I've, I've been playing that since the release, and I absolutely love it. Then again, I've been playing this game since the release, but Grand Theft Auto is just more personal to me because I used to play. I have a lot of the Grand Theft Autos. Uh, and then last, I play Payday. Payday Crime Wave Edition is kind of old, but I play it on the Xbox, and it's really fun. Well, I don't know where I'm going, but it's a really, really, really fun game. Uh, John Wick, you can play it as him from the movies. It's, it's a really fun game, and I actually enjoyed myself. I'm not that high level in it, but... If, if you enjoy doing heists and you enjoy, like, playing with your friends and having, like, a huge challenge, get that game. You will enjoy yourself. I'm not lying. Like, this, that's 100% the truth. And just so you know, if you can tell, my voice is a little bad because I'm a little under the weather. Uh, yeah, so, anyway. I think that's it. Eight minutes should cover the video. I don't think that you guys want to hear me ramble anymore. I'm... Always looking for a camera so I can do a face reveal like thing going on because you know me, I want to show my face in a camera at one point in my life or in my YouTube career. One of the one of the two. So you guys want to see my face? I, I just go ahead, just drop likes, and I'll eventually show it. Actually, you know what? I'll show it anyway. You don't need to drop likes. Just drop likes just because you're nice to me, right? Right? No. Okay. Well. <laughs> anyway. Um. I'm gonna try and look. I'm trying to get all that stuff set up. I'm looking around for one. The research is key. I, I've never really met much people who've like done YouTube for a living, so it's like really all new to me. And I'm I'm trying. I'm trying my best. So bear with me, guys. It's only for a couple longer. I I'm I am getting up there though. I I'm going to admit, for the lack of videos I've been doing lately, I've been I've been getting some pretty. Hefty subscribers, and I'm like, 
you know, I was expecting to lose everybody when I started stopping, but like I'm still gaining some people, not as much as over the summer, but still some people. I'm pretty pretty glad. And I'm really thankful actually because you know, with everything that's going on, I can't really do that many uploads, so it, it really makes me glad seeing you guys subscribe to me and I'm just like twitched there. I'm like, ugh. Uh, uh. Okay, never mind. Okay, so anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, subscribe for more content like this. Don't forget to check out my links in the description, Twitch, Twitter, Facebook, and my friend's channel. And I said that really fast, so you know, I'll check out all that stuff out, even though I don't usually use them, but I will use them eventually when I do get a heftier more amount of subscribers. But I'm still thankful for you guys. Don't get that. Go take that any other way. So anyway, like I said, comment, subscribe for more content like this, Twitch, Twitter, Facebook, and my friend's channel, and I will see you later, bro. I played a little GTA, but Destiny, like, I, every time I play Call of Duty and I go back to Destiny, like, I'm just like, these things are so bullet spongy, it's hard to play this game when there's like a hundred things that you have to kill, and it's, they're all so freaking hard to kill, and I'm just like, come on, seriously, why can't I just headshot when they're dead, like, seriously, I'm gonna have to shoot the captain like five times in the head, and then it dies, like, I don't even know if they add anything. I 